how to trade forex in 2016 euro dollar per part 1 how to trade forex in 2016 euro dollar per part 1 Good morning, good afternoon, uh, good evening, bonjour, bonsoir, mes amis, good morning, good tag, good night. For those of you who are new to us, uh, we are the TSTW24 uh, uh, Traders, and our website is www.stochastic-magdi.com. Once again, the title of this video is uh, How to Trade Forex in 2016, Euro Dollar Pair, Part 1. All right. <clears throat> we will be recording another video, uh, uh, the part two, in February 2016, and we will give traders more tips and tricks for trading the forex in 2016, especially the euro dollar currency pair. <clears throat> for traders that are very new to us, the euro dollar currency pair is the leading currency pair. So if you are trading forex, the first currency pair that you must check is the euro dollar currency pair. The market indicator for the euro dollar currency pair is crude oil. So if one is trading forex or trading the currency pair that are positively correlated to the euro dollar, one must also pay attention to crude oil. All right? The crude oil will influence the forex market. Another thing I need to clarify with traders, traders that are trading forex, you are trading forex when New York is open at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time, 2.30 p.m. London time, okay, the Dow Jones index will also influence the euro dollar and the currency pair that are positively correlated to the euro dollar currency pair. So we need to know those things because we want to know, okay, other market indicators, okay, that are influencing the forex market. Another thing I need to clarify right here with traders, our trading approach is very simple. We want to combine the technical analysis with the fundamental analysis, paying attention to the economy news at Google Finance, at Yahoo Finance, especially for forex trading at www.forexfactory.com. One cannot afford to trade forex just with the technical analysis alone. Very, very important because the economy news can change okay the dynamics of the forex market let's get started my friend so as i explained to trader last year i'm going to go on a yearly chart this is a very very important video trader can refer to this video many many times throughout the year so you can come back to this video to know what's going on the strategy that you must adopt okay so you can apply your trading systems or your trading methods carefully okay so last year, what I said to traders in 2015, at the beginning of the year, I recorded a similar video like this, which I posted at Joe Trio YouTube channel, okay? But this video, I will post it at 24Forest Trader, okay, YouTube channel, not Joe Trio channel. So last year, I was telling traders that uh, we will give priority to bearish signal if the euro is uh, finding resistance below the low of 2014. So the low of 2014 was at a 12097. So here we can see that the euro found a resistance below that level. And throughout 2015, the professional traders were selling the euro dollar currency pair. They were giving priority to bearish trading strategy, bearish trading signal below the low of 2014. This year, all right, my friend, I'm going to say similar thing again, and I want traders to pay attention very carefully to the key levels. I also remind the traders last year, remind the traders last year, that ordinary traders are spending too much time analyzing the technical indicators instead of paying attention to the price. Professional forex traders will trade around key levels. Sophisticated market participants will trade at a specific price, okay? So we want to know, okay, the, the, the most influential, okay, key levels. And I have some levels here, and I want you to have a notebook, okay? Have a notebook, call it Euro Dollar or Forex Trading Notebook. 
and know that those key level. So whether you are day trading or swing trading or position trading in the forex market, I want you to remember those key levels. Okay, very very important. <coughs> so <coughs> my apologies to trader, my voice is gone. Why do we need to know key levels? Okay, so if you receive, for instance, a buy signal or you see a trading setup, okay, you want to make sure those uh, trading signal or those uh, trading setup are taking place on or near or in the vicinity of those key levels, the most influential key levels. Why? Because the hedge funds, the big banks will make decision, will buy or sell around key levels. Whether the signal is has been fired before the prior reaching that level, they will wait until the prior reaches that key level before they will place the trade. So they will just go and say, I want to buy at X price. I want to sell at X specific price. Okay? They will not just buy in the void. So we want traders to adopt the same mindset and to follow, okay, uh, the big market players, okay? To avoid that the video is too long, I want to give you the first key level that we want to watch throughout 2016 because today is the 25th of January 2016. This is the first video for Forex Trading that we are recording that we will post at 24 Forex Trader. So which level we should pay attention to? Very, very important key level right here. The closing price of 2015. Note it down. The closing price of 2015 is at 10865. Priority to bearish signal below the closing price of 2015. If the euro dollar found a resistance below the level of 10865, we must give priority to sell signal until the price reaches the low of 2015. So the first key level is 10865. That's the closing price for the euro dollar, okay, in 2015. I'm going to go quickly to the daily chart and I want to show you what is happening right now. That's the green line here, 10865, the closing price. So if you have been trading at the beginning of this year, which is uh, 2016, all right, good news. Look at the, what the price is doing here around that level. is oscillating. So this is what we call a fractal pattern. Why is it fractal pattern? Because there is a, a bigger consolidation that is taking place on the monthly chart. The price is oscillating around the same level, 10865. On the daily chart, the same pattern has copied itself and pasted itself on the daily chart. We have the same pattern that is duplicating itself on the daily chart. This is what we call predictive uh, fractal pattern, not the ordinary fractal pattern. Mr. Benoit Mandebrot, predictive fractal patterns. So here we have a consolidation taking place already around that key level. So you can see that the professional uh, are acknowledging this key level 10865. Priority to bullish signal above, priority to bear signal below. But right now on a daily chart, we cannot ignore the price structure, what I say to traders, the price structure commands the trading strategy that we can apply. So we must check first the price structure, the market pattern, we determine which strategy we are using. So right now, though I said that we must give priority to bearish signal below this level, the price is consolidating around that level on a daily chart, okay? All right, so, if I want to sell below that level, I would prefer to sell, okay, here, on top of the consolidation because of the price structure. Though the price will be above that level, this is the best place to look for opportunity to sell as the price will go down more. It's the best place to sell, not here, because a lot of traders are buying here. This is about the price structure around 10865. The price structure or the market pattern will determine the, the, the trading strategy that we can apply. Okay, very important. Priority to be bearish signal below 10865, but the price structure will determine the trading strategy that we must adopt. 
I will remove this line because I don't want the video to be too long. So we have one key level, 10865, that's the closing price. So we will give priority to bear signal below that level until the price reaches the low of 2015. The low of 2015 is at uh, 10462. So we will give priority to bear signal until the price reaches that level. If the price reaches that level, by the time the price reaches that level, I'll record, it. I'll record the part two of this series of video to tell you exactly which strategy we should adopt. But remember now, this is the most important key level that we must not forget, okay? There is another key level. So we talk about the low of 2015, which is at uh, 10462. That's the, the light gray line here. There is another key level here. That's the median line of 2015 for the euro dollar currency pair the media line is at 11259 so as i told you we want to give priority to bear signal below 10865 until the price reaches the level of 10462 on the other hand if we receive a buy signal above 10865 we will give priority to bullish signal until the price reaches the level of 11259. All right? 11259. So three levels. The top is 11259. The, the one below, 10462. The one in the middle, which is the most important level that we are watching throughout 2015, 10865. If you forget anything else, don't forget these three key levels. The, price, the euro dollar must find a support above 11259 before we can say that it's completely bullish. So far, if it's bullish above the middle line, which is 10865, the closing price of 2015, and we are buying, it's not completely bullish. Be aware of the media line at 11259. The only time that the bull can sit down and relax, so to speak, is when the euro dollar finds support, a valid support, above the level of 11259, which is the media line of 2015. It makes sense. It's also powerful. There is another key level. So if the euro dollar finally find a support above the media line and start going up, there is another key level I want you to pay attention to. It's right here. That's the low of 2010. Why am I looking at this one? Because the low of that uh, 2010 candlestick bar is, is coming to the range of 2015 candlestick bar. Therefore, we cannot ignore that key level. The low of 2000, okay, the low of 2008. And 10 candlestick bar is at 11875. That's the pink line here. 11875. So priority to bullish signal above 10865, closing price of 2015. But we must be careful. It's not completely bullish. But we must be aware of the media line. If we find a support above the media line, we must be aware of the low of 2015, 11875. All right? There is another resistance here at 12069. That's the high of 2015. To summarize this video, the level that we are watching, the most important level that we must watch throughout 2016 is 10865. The next key level that we must pay attention to is 11259, which is the media line of 2015. 15. Apart from these important two key levels, we must also pay attention to the level of 10462, the level of 11875, and the level of 12069. For traders that are swing trading, there is a web page at www.stochasticmoney.com that we call Weekly Chart Swing Trader. Click on it and know how to swing trade using the, the weekly chart as a trading setup, the 4-hour chart for the signal, and the 15-minute chart for the entry. You will find more trading tips, more swing trading tips and tricks at, on our website and also day trading tips and tricks on, the, on, the, on our website. If you are trading, the most important thing, my friend, we want to find a valid trading setup. 
those valid training setup will take place around key levels, most influential key level. When we see a training setup on a higher time frame, we must wait for the signal on another time frame and enter the train on another time frame. This is what we call multiple time frame trading method. The forbidden trading mistake is the violation of the top-down trading method. Now, apart, we don't want to repeat that mistake. We don't want to commit that mistake. We want to overcome that trading mistake. Very, very important. Otherwise, we will be going round, round, round. The next mistake that traders also make is the breach of the condominiums. For foreign trader, one cannot get away with it because once in a while you will see a tall candle that will work in your favor. Another time, we need to know when the high impact economy news are due. So, if you are a technical trader using trading tool, mark the stochastic RSI trading system, trading method. One should always combine those trading tool with the economy news and the fundamentals. It makes sense. This is part one: how to trade for us in 2016 euro dollar currency pair. I will be recording another video in February, okay, 2016. That will be part two. I will be talking about the equilibrium, the short-term equilibrium price level, and the long-term equilibrium price level for the euro dollar currency pair. Somewhere around the line, uh, somewhere around April, I'll record another video when I will pinpoint the six critical price level for the euro dollar currency pair. Professional traders will make decisions around key level. As you can see last year, they saw the euro below the low of 2014, and the euro couldn't go above it, a priority to bear signal all year long. And the year was coming to the end, they took profit, that's why we have this tail here. So they took a bit of profit, okay? That's why this level here, 10865, is a very, very important key level. We wish you the very best in your forex trading, and until the next time, enjoy yourself and be very happy. So you may say to me, George, what should I do with this key level? They are just key level. Now, what did I say? I say also that the most important thing is what? The price structure. You can see that on the monthly chart, we have a consolidation here, all right? Between the media line, 11259, and the low, 10462. The closing price of 2015, it became the media line of this uh, channel here. So the price oscillating between the media line, 11259, and the low of 2015, 10462. If you, as I said to you, priority to bear signal below the 10862, uh, 10865 until we reach this level 10462. The same rule apply when we agree when the price for the support above 10865 until it reaches the median line 11259. The price structure will determine our trading strategy. If there was a bearish channel before, now we have a consolidation that is taking place on the monthly chart. Do not forget that until the market pattern. Uh, will change or has changed, okay? It makes sense? It is also powerful. So if I go now to the weekly chart, you see similar pattern, okay? Consolidation again, same rule, same thing apply. We go to the, to the daily chart. The key level the professional are watching is the closing price of 2015, this level here. So if you are day trading, don't forget that there's a consolidation on the daily chart also, a fractal pattern, a pattern that has formed on the daily on the monthly chart is duplicating itself on the daily chart around the media line around the, 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 the closing price of 2015. Until the next time, enjoy yourself and be very happy. If you like this video, please give us the thumbs up. If you dislike it, make sure you give us the thumbs down. Doesn't matter. All right. And if you love this video, feel free to share it on Google Plus, on Twitter, and also on Facebook. If you love our video, it's time to hit the subscribe button so you may watch more tutorials like this, all right? And you, stay, you may stay tuned, okay, and improve your forex trading. We are the TSTW24 traders talking about how to trade forex in 2016 euro dollar pair part one.